The University of Toronto Institute for Aerospace Studies UTIAS, UTIS, is an advanced research facility for aeronautics and aerospace engineering, located in the Downsview District of Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Established in 1949 by founding director Gordon N. Patterson, the institute is managed by the University of Toronto Faculty of Applied Science and Engineering and mainly receives funding from governmental agencies such as the National Research Council, the Department of National Defence and the Canadian Space Agency. Notable international sponsors include the European Space Agency, Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory, Max Planck Institute for Plasmaphysic, NASA Ames Research Centre and the United Kingdom Atomic Energy Authority. History In 1970, the Institute was involved in the emergency rescue of the Apollo 13 astronauts, after the mission was aborted by a major accident en route to the Moon. UTIAS was contacted for assistance due to its expertise in shockwaves and aerospace dynamics. Engineers and scientists at UTIAS calculated the amount of pressure needed to separate the lunar module from the command – service module without damaging the hatch, allowing the crew to survive the re-entry to Earth. Observing the 40th anniversary of the incident in 2010, Lunar Module pilot Fred Hayes wrote a letter thanking the UTIAS team for its contribution. In recent years, the Institute has produced the world's first microwave powered aircraft, the world's first engine powered ornithopter, both inventions of James Delorier, and Canada's first space telescope. Most, the major expertise areas represented are aircraft design, particularly at subsonic speeds, flight simulation, space space mechatronics and robotics, microsatellite technology, computational fluid dynamics and nuclear fusion. The Institute's partners in the aerospace industry include Bombardier Aerospace, MD Robotics formerly SPAR Aerospace and General Atomics. It operates the Canadian Advanced Nanospace Experiment Program for the study and testing of nanosatellite technology. Topic. Past faculty The following professors have been granted Professor Emeritus status at UTIAS Past professors Topic Notable alumni Gerald Bull, Ph.D., 1950, one of the world's leading experts in ballistics, developer of advanced artillery, assassinated in 1990. Thomas Sidon, MASC, and Ph.D., 1968, served as Canadian Federal Secretary of State for Science and Technology, Minister of Fisheries and Oceans, Minister of Indian Affairs and Northern Development, and Minister of National Defence. Topic: Aircraft. UTIAS Ornithopter No. One. UTIAS Snowbird Topic Rockets Nanosatellite Launch System Topic UTIAS Developed Satellites Launched Most, launched 30 June 2003 Structure, Thermal, Onboard Computer and Communication Subsystems, also Ground Station Canix-1, launched with Most Canix-2, launched 28 April 2008 NTS, Nanosatellite Tracking Ships, launched 28 April 2008 Build for Comdiv AISSAT-1, launched 12 July 2010, built for Norwegian Defence Research Establishment. Canix-3 satellites, TUGSAT-1 and UNIBRITE-1 launched 25 February 2013. 